folks, this is the Liu View channel. My name is Martin. I hope you have a great day. Today we make a dish is called the chicken, mushroom, and uh, sweet potato rice noodle stew. Uh, Chinese name called xiao ji dun mo gu, ji kuai dun fen tiao. And uh, the main ingredient we need is uh, uh, two pieces of uh, uh, chicken breast and uh, and uh, fowl mushroom, it's a Chinese black mushroom. Uh, this mushroom and you can buy from Asian market, also sometimes called shi tik mushroom, I forgot the name. And uh, you just soak in the water, Chinese name called xiang gu. Add uh, one cup of water, first rinse the mushroom and then add one cup of water and soak this mushroom, it will become soft. And also need a, uh, a handful of sweet potato noodles you can buy from the, the Asian market like this. You just need a handful of sweet, sweet potato mushroom and two scallion or green onion, uh, one teaspoon and one tablespoon ginger and two star anise. Those are the main ingredients we need for this dish. Okay, we cut the scallion. This scallion already washed and pick up the uh, yellow dead leaves. Now cut the root off. Then we, we cut it small. If you can't cut it small, you try to cut it small like this. Small. If you can't cut it small, you can. Uh, what you, you can just after you cut it, you can chop it. Try to chop it small. Here we cut the ginger. We need a one teaspoon, one tablespoon of ginger. So we just cut it properly. Four fine piece of ginger. Or you can get, you can get a uh, chopped ginger from the freezer and uh, and let it as uh, a saw and use it. Ginger we get. Okay, we cut the mushroom. We get the mushroom from the water, and uh, you can squeeze the water from the mushroom. to squeeze it. This water will really we we'll use it. Don't uh, don't uh, throw, don't uh, dump it. This water we we'll use it as a flavor. Squeeze the water. And put this here with water, soaking water. We use it. Now, right now, we slice it. Okay. This one I back. Just put it here. Put it. Just leave it here. So we cut it like this. This is a uh, Chinese black mushroom. We cut it. And we soak in the water for uh, yeah for four thirty minutes to one hour, and it becomes soft. So then we cut it. Okay, we cut the chicken breast. This chicken breast have some of the bones. So when we cut it, we just uh, just cut it like this. Get a fork. We just uh, it's, it's not enough. Then we cut it from the here from the middle. Okay. Yeah, this the then we we'll cut it like this. The bone we just leave there. It's okay. When we eat it, we just get, get away. And come here like this. Just big piece of chunk. So it'll be like this. And this we cut it like this. Okay. 
so we're gonna cut it like this, put it in the, in the plate. If you don't want the bone in the chicken, you can just cut it, uh, you see the chicken that one here, you just uh, cut it like this, careful, uh, uh, around the bone, so be, be very careful. Get the meat off the bone. The bone the you can also be cut it. The bone is a good flavor, so we stay with it. So we just stay with a big chunk. Okay. So this why the one have a bones or just the bones you can get. Cut it along the bone, just be careful. So, so this piece of bone, we don't have bones. So it's all up to you. Up to you, so you can decide. We will cut like this. If you don't want bones, you can get the bone. Just cook it with the meat. With the meat, without the bones. This is the trick you will get. On the stove, medium fair. When the pot is hot, we add a quarter cup vegetable oil to it. Because the way we fry a lot of veggies, uh, fry, uh, fry a lot of uh, chicken, so we need uh, uh, a quarter cup of oil. We can add a piece of uh, scallion to see if the oil is ready or not. The oil is ready, so we add the scallion, ginger, and star anise into the oil. Slowly fry. Slowly fry until the scallion, ginger, and the star anise really good smell, but don't uh, burn the, the, the scallion, ginger. When the scallion changer and the is really good smell, we add the chicken into it. Don't add the water. Slowly fry. And here, uh, slowly fry, let the chicken fat come out from meat and go into the oil. So it's just slowly fry. And also get the water, some kind of like uh, extra water out from the chicken. When you fry the chicken, prepare some hot water because we use it later. You can see the just the fry, don't let the chicken stick to the pot. You see the chicken are mostly the all become the white. We add a mushroom into it. And the keep it slowly fry. You just fry it and fry it a long time. Slowly fry. Right now you see the it's just uh, the oil and the chicken and in the pot and the chicken is also uh, become white, pretty white. Then this is the dark soy sauce. We add a uh, I think it's a two tablespoon dark soy sauce. Okay, keep frying. So oh, I fry a long time and my arm is already soft. So just uh, you, yeah, just uh, let it slowly fry. So we don't do it in rush. Okay. Right now we add the salt. This is the salt. We add a, uh, one tablespoon of salt to it. One tablespoon of salt to it.
this is that a, a mushroom that a, we added the mushroom that's the, the soaked mushroom water into the chicken. This is the plain sugar. We add uh, one teaspoon of uh, plain sugar to it to give it a good flavor. And fry. This is the hot water. We add uh, the bo uh, boiling water. Married with one cup. Two cup, three cup. We add a three cup hot boiling water to it. So the most, so the all the chicken is soaked in the in hot water. Okay, put the lid on until it's the boiling. Until it is boiling. When it's boiling, we take the uh, medium fair to the low medium fair. Uh, just a light, uh, you can see still boiling, just let it slowly cook for 10 minutes. This is the uh, sweet, uh, uh, sweet potato noodles. We get it out. Get it, we get it out. I will use the cool tap to rinse it. So there's no dust on the pot. Let's use the hot tap on the rinse After rinse it, dump the water, and we put it uh, in, a, in a pot. We we'll use it later. Just let the meat slowly cook in the pot and turn the fire on the medium and the slow boiling in the pot for 10 minutes and uh, you need to watch it, don't, don't heat the pot too big and uh, dry the pot. We just want the, uh, the chicken to fully cooked. We just uh, slowly cook for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes we check the chicken. We can see we poke it easy, the poke it through and no no blood stuff come out, so this chicken is uh, it's already fully cooked. This is the uh, sweet potato noodles we, we added to it with the chopstick. To boil it, and the, the sauce to boil it. Just slowly cook, just let it cook, and it will become soft. And then we recover the lid, let it cook for five minutes. Let it cook for five minutes. We we'll check it. After uh, two minutes, one, two minutes, and uh, remember, and uh, to the Sweet potato noodle become soft, so try to stir it. Let it all soak in this so uh, this uh, sauce, so the sweet potato and can be fully cooked. Sweet potato noodle can be fully cooked. So. Okay, we cover it. Let it keep cooling and rain. Now the kitchen temperature to medium fair. Let it cooking, cook it, keep cooking. After five minutes, we check the rice noodle. We can use the, the chopstick to pinch. If the easy to pinch, 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 you pinch, pinch, then means this will be ready. It's fully cooked with meat. You can, you can use the chopstick to pinch it, or you can try it. We try this. Hmm. Still need to cook uh, probably extra five minutes. Can I taste it? So let it cook extra five minutes. After uh, uh, extra five minutes, we check the careful stirring. 
don't let the the powder dry. Just remember, if the, if powder dry, the rice noodle is still not cool, not uh, become soft. Then you need to add hot water into it. Right now we pinch it. It's easy. Uh, let me see. If it's easy to pinch, it's easy. Let me see. It's easy to pinch. pinch so pinch it all. Pinch it to two pieces. That means the rice noodle is ready. I will try it. Hmm. The not rice noodle. The sweet potato noodles. Yeah, brand is done. It's easy to pinch it. Pinch it up, and also taste the very uh, taste not hard. The texture is good. So this dish is not complicated. So the chicken, uh, mushroom, and the sweet potato noodles uh, stole this dish is done. Chinese name called uh, Xiao Ji Dui Mo Gu or Ji Kuai Dui Fan Zhao. Uh, I hope you like it. Like it. Please sub subscribe, share, like, and comment. And see you next time.